What's up guys and welcome to my first ever video on a next gen console. That's right baby, we're going to be playing Dirt 5 here on the Xbox Series X. It is so incredibly beautiful, my goodness, I love it and uh, I can't wait to hop into it. So you guys know Dirt 5 recently released on the current gen consoles. It's going to be coming out on the Series X on the 10th and then on the PS5 on the 12th. And uh, we've been playing it, we've been playing career mode and stuff like that, which has been great, but I figured today we could check out a couple of the other modes. So obviously career mode is a huge deal in this game. We've also got different online modes, we've got arcade, and we've got playgrounds, which I'm super excited about, and I think the community's gonna come up with some really cool stuff once people get their hands on it. So if you guys like the game, if you're interested, if you wanna pick it up, feel free to check out that top link down in the description. It's gonna have all the info you need. You can get your pre-order in. It's honestly a ton of fun, and it's, it's one of the games it's bringing in the next generation of consoles, so it's very, very exciting. Uh, thank you so much to Codemasters for sponsoring this video, giving me early access, and allowing me to post early for you guys here. So, without further ado, let's hop into some Playgrounds. So I'm sure most of you guys know, but Playgrounds is all about the community. It's all about designing, creating, editing, and then publishing your own custom-made tracks and challenges and Gate crashers and gym connas and everything else. Like you can create these crazy maps, these crazy tracks, these crazy arenas, whatever you want to do, and then you can publish it and share it with your friends or share it with the world, which is pretty amazing. Now, obviously, we've got early access here, so there aren't a ton of people with the game yet. However, there are some pretty interesting ones we're going to be able to check out. So I say let's let's check out a few of the popular ones here. We've got X Games 2020, 710 hearts. Let's see what this is about. Start the countdown, baby. Here we go. It's lights out, and away we go here on X Games 2020. So, uh, dude, this thing is is absolutely ridiculous. This is a gate crasher event, which is basically like a point-to-point -point, go through the checkpoints as fast as possible, just set the best time possible. You guys can see two minutes and, and 58 seconds is going to be our, our time to beat. That's our... Uh, that's our world record time currently, so we're gonna see if we can uh, see if we can improve upon that. I've got a feeling if I was Bone Crushers, I'd be feeling pretty safe right about now, but who knows? Not gonna count ourselves out until we cross that finish line, baby. Making a left here. We've got like little puddles of water. Oh shoot! Okay, we got a, a little bit a little bit sloppy on that turn there. It's all about like using enough e-brake to be able to slide around these corners, but not too much that you keep your speed and momentum. It's, you know, sometimes you want to be going super fast. Other times you don't want to go as fast. Like right there, we let off the gas a little bit. It ended up working out for us. Got a nice little hairpin here. A little bit too fast. That's all right though. We're, we're going to make it work. A little jump here. Fireworks going off at every checkpoint, which is exciting. Came in way too hot, but it's, I mean, it's, it's whatever. This is a rental. I'm gonna be able to return this to him right afterwards, so don't really have to take care of it too much, right? Making our way up this thing. Oh, come on, baby. Come on. Dude, I, I would imagine somebody's gonna have the ability to be able to just straight up drift that entire thing. That would be pretty impressive. Went all the way up, and now it looks like we might be going all the way down. Dude, this is this is like an airport parking garage. Can't even remember the last time I saw one of those. Thanks to Dirt 5 and Xbox Series X, I can now feel like I'm actually traveling somewhere here in quarantine. Making our way through here. Ooh, see, we've got some uneven terrain. Definitely want to try to slow that down. Come around this way. I think I'm just going to send it. We'll see what happens. Actually pretty smooth. Okay, what do we have going on here? Oh, all right. Uh, excavator kind of got in our way a little bit. I don't know if the correct answer was to go on the inside or the outside there. It kind of seems like we may have we may have messed that one up a little bit, but we're just gonna keep on keep on trucking here. Make sure you break in time, Trev, but don't don't turn it in too early. Ooh. Okay. So this is like the, the parking garage thing, but uneven here. Woo! Dude, it's crazy to think that this was just a flat patch of, of you know, dirt in the middle of the desert, and every single one of these pieces that you're seeing was individually placed and managed and edited and stuff like that. That's just like, that, that's what I'm, I'm excited, okay, okay. Well, there goes our, our hopes and dreams of a world record right there. That's what I'm excited for. I can't wait to see what the community does when they get their hands on the game, you know what I mean? Like, I, I just, I feel like there are gonna be so many creative people, and this is gonna be a mode that you never really run out of content. If people are constantly creating new content, 
you never run out of it, which is, is pretty exciting. Come on, baby. Here we go. Try to make it to that finish line. Let's see what kind of a time we can put up. Looks like we got a 317. We had a couple of spots where we definitely could have done better, but that's going to put us at 116. Try to see how many people have played it. Looks like it's been played 992 times by 819 people, and we got 116th, so... That's not bad. I, I, I think we could do quite a bit better, but uh, that's that's decent for a little warm up there. Let's hop into our next one. Our goal to beat is 103, and we're gonna see just how close we can get. Now the thing is, the thing that's great about these is that they're they're so fast, and especially with with the Series X and next gen consoles in general, like the loading times are so quick that if you mess up, you can quickly retry. And I, I think that's kind of you know part of the the challenge and the point of this playgrounds mode is, is like if you have a little mess up you just hit retry and you uh you, you try it again you know what i mean so like we hit that all right i'm gonna say let's let's retry this i think we can do a little bit better i think we need to use a little bit less e-brake we're gonna go right back to the start no loading times just straight back down to the countdown and uh here we go so we gotta we gotta beat 103 Ooh, see mess that up there you gotta memorize it like you gotta play it a few times memorize like oh i've got a swoopy turn here i've got a hairpin turn here Need to be careful, need to slow it down more, whatever else. So here we go. We got a swoopy turn. And then we got a bit of a hairpin. Kind of took that a little bit wide, but we just want to carry that momentum. A bit more of a swoopy here. Hit the hit the front corner, but I honestly don't think that's the worst thing to happen in the world. Let's come around here. Beautiful work. A little bit harder. Probably could have cut it in more there, but we're fine. Nice, nice there, but probably could have cut it back faster. Shoot, dude. I say we did, let's just, let's finish it, let's see where we're at, and let's, let's see where we can improve. So basically, I, I mean, you guys can see this is such a massive difference over what we originally saw. Ooh, what do you think our best route through here is? I was trying to get away from all the bumps, but I don't think we did very well there. But yeah, this, this is another one that, like, that last one was pretty intense, really well done. Lots of crazy turns and hoops and stuff to jump through and everything else, like literal flaming hoops. This one's just a bunch of double-decker buses. But in a way, it's equally as fun, which is, is interesting. This I, I, just, I, can't, I can't wait to see when people get their hands on it. It's going to be insane. So we won a 103. We got a little over a 108, 108.8. So we'll, we'll take it. That's going to put us in 14th place. I'd like to try to crack the top 10. This one is actually looking amazing so far. Dude, I don't, I don't know how to... No! Dude, we had a we. I, I think we even with that. I think we might be on a on a good run here. Come on, baby. Come on, shoot. I kind of forget. I forget what happens through here. I hate all the little bumps. I, I think. I, oh, come on. Never know what to do with these bumps, dude. This one. This one feels pretty good though. Here we go. Shoot. I kind of forget this segment. Is it a hard? It's a hard one, isn't it? Yep. All right, there it is. Now we got to straight to the finish. We got the jump and the jump. Come on, go, 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 go. Shoot, dude, 103 seems so out of reach. We got a 107.6. That's going to put us in sixth place. Oh. Dude, how do you shave four seconds off of that? I think we could get top five. I think getting, I, I think we could possibly even get top four. I think getting into the low sixes would be really, really tough. P6, baby, we'll take it. I love it. So, uh, you know, again, it is early access vast majority of the population does not have this game yet but people have played it 549 times so far there are 455 individuals who have played it and out of those 455 we are in the number six spot which is is pretty solid so let's uh let's see let's see what other kind of trouble we can get into here oh the challenge what's the time to beat let me out of baby i'm trying to, i'm trying to get that p1 let's go what do we have uh, Bone Crushers with a 206. Okay, so it, it looks like he's got a tends to be top of the leaderboard so far. We're, we're gonna see what we can do here. We've got a, a long run up there. Gonna break. Oh my goodness, that was about the smoothest we could have possibly been. Ooh, we've got some some choice action. We could have gone right or left. Not sure what the answer was, but we're, we're, we're just gonna choose it and send it, baby. Going through here, right or left. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go left, I think. Okay, we're good. Just flirting with the wall a little bit. That's fine. A little, little bit of, you know, nice conversation. Never hurt anybody. Okay, we've got some whoops here. Got a break. Let's get it under control. Get around this corner. Gonna keep on going. We've got some fire in front of us. We've got tires. 
Okay, just send it right through them. We're gonna be fine. Here we go. Oh, we got a, a right hand turn. Watch out for those walls, dude. Here we go. All right, going right up the, the mountain here. This is, this, okay, now left. Dude, this is so sketchy. But obviously, if you play these over and over and you, you kind of replay them and, and do your thing. Oop, I'm gonna go right. I don't know what the correct answer was. Probably left there. Oh, no, don't hit the wall trap. No! I think if we would have gone left back there, we would have had a straighter entry into this section. Just keep going. That was smooth right there. We're at 122 with 6 out of 13, which is not exactly the pace we want to be on, but I guess we could have uh, checkpoints closer together coming up here. Come on, baby. Go, go, go. Send it, send it, send it. Get after it. Oh, my goodness. What is happening? I'm going to make sure we don't clip our roof on that one up there. All right. Going to be coming through here. Let's go ahead and drift. Oh, dude, this is sick. Are you kidding me? Ride the wave, bruh. Join the wave. I'm taking your top spot. Probably not, though. Ooh, watch your head on that one, Trev. Dude, this is this is insane. We're good. We're going to be taking a left here. There's so much happening, I'm not even sure what I'm looking at at, at times. Straight to the finish. Go, go, go. Oh, 210. We got sixth place again. I think... I think we could probably get top three. We did it, baby! Let's go! Oh my goodness, dude. The beginning was the hardest part, without a doubt. Just the, the first drop-off part when you, you have to drop off. I ended up just breaking a lot and, and you know, kind of slowly going through it. But we got a 209.7. I mean, we, we could probably shave off another second. I, I don't know if we could catch Bone Crushers though. Bone Crushers is a beast. I don't know if he's a dev or what, but good job to him. Shout out to him. We're uh, we're gonna keep on grinding. Hold up, baby. This is gonna be monumental. Our first ever Dirt Five online race and first ever online game on the Series X. Let's get it, baby. Here we go. Racing online for the very first time. I don't even know. What track this is, I don't think I've ever raced on this track before, so it's going to be interesting, but we're off to a decent start so far. Bone Lord up there is... Oh, okay, all right. We're, we're, kind, of, we're kind of all getting into some, some craziness here. Now I'm back in last place. I was going to say Bone Lord's flying up there. He can hardly keep it together. He's just rock solid. You know, hard, hard as a rock up there in, in first place. Shoot, okay. I'm going to take, uh, I guess technically you could kind of take a, a little bit of a shortcut through there, huh? We're going to keep that in mind. Not like we're going to have a second lap in this race. Um, it's a point to point, but uh, I guess I guess we'll see what happens. So, yeah, but I would assume the grass probably slows you down quite a bit, but we'll, we'll see. We're in this Volkswagen thing, and it appears... That it's pretty slow, at least on the straights. Come on, baby. 47% of the way through this race. Come on, baby. Oh my gosh, I just, I want more power. I feel like we chose the wrong car. I chose this thing because it looked interesting. It looked different. It's a really weird looking like Volkswagen Lancia mix. I don't even know what to call it. Kind of looks like a Lancia in the headlights, I guess. But I feel like we just can't, we can't find the speed that we're looking for. I feel like she's driving pretty well, but maybe because we're driving so slow. See, can I? Ah, you can't. You you cannot cut corners. Well, this was an unfortunate first performance. My good friend Justin Bieber once told me, "Never say never." <laughs> so we're 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 gonna stay confident. Come on, baby. Bone Lord, and dude, all of us that picked this Volkswagen, whatever the heck this thing is, are all back in the very back. The absolute worst that we can get. We're at 94%. I'm trying to pass Bone Lord here. We've got the speed. We got him. He tried to turn into us. We got we got fourth place. We'll take it. Definitely didn't choose the right vehicle. Dude, imagine your first game on a brand new console, on a brand new game, start of a century of gaming ahead of you, and you have a performance like that. So there you guys have it. Little preview of Dirt 5 here on the Xbox Series X. We've got to work on our multiplayer game a little bit, but uh, all in all, just an absolute blast. I look forward to getting back into the career mode. We're going to get back to that series here very soon, but 
This was fun, man. I mean, I, I love playgrounds. The online racing's pretty fun. You've got both the regular races like we just did, as well as party games and stuff. So there's a lot of content here. If you guys want to check out the game for yourself, be sure to check out that top link down in the description. Get your order in, whether it's for a current gen console or if you're getting a next gen console. Hook it up, have some fun, race around, and uh, throw up some dirt. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you so much, Dirt, for sponsoring this video. I'm going to see you guys later. Peace out.